Hey everyone, I'm Alan Thrall. It's been a while since I've done a product review video. And in this video, I'm reviewing the Dumbler by Gungnir. It's a loadable dumbbell. Traditional dumbbells are a fixed weight. The Dumbler allows you to load these handles in whatever increments you'd like based on the plates that you have available. My first impressions, uh, these are the highest quality loadable handles that I've ever seen on par with what you'd expect from an expensive barbell. The grippy knurling that you can actually feel, it's got the same bushing sleeve that most barbells use versus just a bolt holding the sleeve on the shaft like I've seen before, uh, which makes the sleeve very susceptible to loosening and falling apart or sliding off. What makes these unique beyond what I've already mentioned is the built-in collar or uh, rail system. What I'm assuming is a high strength magnet paired with these notches is what holds the collars in place and they can support a lot of weight. They're also discreet. They only take up a small area of the dumbbell sleeve, unlike big bulky plastic collars. So these dumbbells aren't perfect. I think the three things to mention, the three drawbacks would be one, the price. They're expensive, but honestly, I'm, I'm really not surprised. Good quality gym equipment is expensive nowadays, but I do think that these are worth it, especially considering the price for a set of dumbbells. The next thing would be the fact that if you were uh, uh, getting these for your home gym and you wanted to use some heavy weight on this, you would need four 25s. Usually uh, you'll have a set of 45s, but then you know a pair of 25s, a pair of 10s, maybe two pairs of 10s, fives, two and a half, et cetera. Um, so you would need a whole bunch of small plates or at least four 25s. You could load these up with 45 plates or 20 kilo plates. Uh, that just might get to be a bit bulky. So that's something to consider. You might need more plates than you already have. And my biggest gripe would be the tightness of the fit. So sliding this on, these are the Troy calibrated pound plates uh, on the powerlifting side of Untamed Strength. And when the collar is as tight as it goes, there's still a little bit of slop in this plate. This is a rubber uh, Rogue calibrated five kilo plate and the fit is uh, tighter. It's snug, more snug than the pound plate. As you can see here, not as much play. This is a powerlifting plate, calibrated iron five kilo plate, uh, about the same amount of slop as the calibrated Troy plate. So if you have thicker plates or thinner plates, it's gonna affect where this notch clicks in. And I think the most embarrassing part of this all, this is just an old uh, 10 pound plate on the strongman side. Uh, so it slides on nicely, tighten it down. Whoops. I'll show you that again. Collar just slides right off it. So this is obviously a larger diameter, uh, much bigger than a barbell sleeve. So this collar, because it's so subtle, low profile, uh, sometimes it doesn't do its job. So if you have just a bunch of random plates at home, I'd hate for you to buy these dumbbells and be unpleasantly surprised that your plates don't even secure on the end of the bar. Other than that, I talked to the owner of the company, told him that, uh, hey, these do have some slop in them. And uh, he said he knows uh, that's kind of unavoidable. But he assured me that these are extremely strong collars and they're gonna hold the weight, obviously, if your plate fits. This is what they look like with two 25 pound plates and a 10 pound plate. It's definitely a strong collar. And here they are with one, two, three, four, five 10 kilo plates, 50 kilos. I'd say these were pretty strong. Okay, since I know you guys are gonna ask. Let's check the diameter. Looks like two inch diameter right on the dot. This one here, not sure what this manufacturer was doing. Cap. Oh yeah, two and three eighths. If your plates measure that in diameter, two and three eighths, they're too big. All right, enough talk, let's test them out.
All right, enough of the light stuff. Let's try out some heavier exercises. Okay, so if you're interested in some loadable dumbbells, I would highly suggest these. I think these are great. They might not make much practical sense for a, a gym like this or a commercial gym with a full set of dumbbells, but if you don't have dumbbells, maybe you're a personal training studio or just a small studio, uh, you don't have the room for a full dumbbell rack footprint or the money to fork over for an entire set, uh, these make a lot of sense. Or if you're a home gym owner, this makes a lot more sense than having a full set of dumbbells. So the reason I'm reviewing these, the owner contacted me and asked if I wanted a free pair of these in exchange for a YouTube video. So this is my honest review of the product. I'm not being paid necessarily to say good things. Uh, I did get a free pair of these though, so there's that. They are doing Black Friday deals today through the weekend. I think as far as in the next week, I'll link those down in the description area. Thanks for watching and always remember, train on time.